Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying four different coffees for you. These were sent to us from Daniel, so thank you very much to Daniel. Uh, this is, we don't know these brands, so if we've pronounced the names wrong, I apologize, life moves on. Uh, we have the Barney's Medium uh, Colombian Organic Coffee. We have the Garibaldi 100% uh, Colombian uh, Coffee. And then this one is the Garibaldi uh, French Roast. And then this is the Rev No Surrender Coffee. Was there a Rev car? A Rev? Mm -hmm. Seems like there was a car called a Rev or something like that. Anyway, uh, so first we're gonna try the Barney's. Barney's Coffee and Tea Company, medium coffee. It is Colombian organic, and that's that's all it says, USDA organic. Yeah, so, we did three sweeteners and two creamers and powder creamer in, in each one of these, 10 ounces. You put strong and bitter. That is what I call hospital coffee. <laughs> cheap, it tastes like cheap coffee. It, it, that's what like I it's call. It's been hospital. in the pot too long. That's hospital coffee. Is like they made it or like four in the morning, and you come in at ten o'clock and and in the afternoon, and, and it's still there. And, and that's that's coffee how, pot's never cleaned out. It's so. never cleaned out. It's been there for twenty it's, years. It's got a bitter, very yeah. Bitter that's what it tastes like. It's hospital coffee. Um, Hmm. Yeah, it's not horrible. It's, it's not horrible. If you don't mind bitter coffee. Yes, you know. then it's fine. It is it is strong and bitter though. That's that's that coffee. This is the Garibaldi uh, Grand Cafe uh, Coffee Cafe. It is 100% Colombian. It's a little bit of I love that mug. I feel like I need to hold a pinky out when I'm drinking it. No, it's not bad. It's got a little bit of a earthy aftertaste, but it's not bad. It tastes, it's not as bitter as the first one. This cup has the Cheshire cat on it. Yeah, it disappears when it's, ah! I mean, it, it appears when it's gotten hot. I had forgotten about that. I haven't used this mug in a while, so um, I, put, I put some mugs I have some mugs in the cabinet. I have mugs all over the house, okay? I even have, I have mugs out in the den and whatever. So um, when I'm doing coffee reviews, stuff like this, I'll go get mugs from wherever and wash them and we'll use them for these reviews because I like to actually use the mugs, you know? Um, and uh, so this one was in the dining room on the shelf and I had just forgotten that when you put hot, a hot beverage in it, that Cheshire Cat shows up. So that's cool. Um, I actually like this coffee a lot more. Oh yeah, much more. better. Um, it's still got a little bitterness to it, but it's not as bad. It does, yes, but it doesn't have that dirty coffee pot bitterness right. that the first one had. Right, exactly. So it still is a stronger coffee though, if you're looking for something strong, uh, but it has a nice flavor. Yeah, yeah, it's got an earthiness to it, but it's good. The next one is a Garibaldi. This is a French, French, roast. French roast, and um, I don't know about the French roast. It doesn't say if it's medium or dark or anything like the light or anything, roast-wise. Yeah, but I'm thinking that Daniel has sent us like three of the kinds we've had were French roast so far. And I don't think I'd much care for any of them. No, no, I like that one. It's all right. No, I like that. I like that one better than the previous one. Um, I like I, the flavor one. I don't. I like the Colombian more really? than the French roast. Oh, yes. I like yeah, those French roast. It's just a different. Um, I think they're earthier. <laughs> it has an earthier yeah. flavor to it. It still is um, strong, but it um, it's just it has that earthiness to it and. I don't, I really don't think I've cared for any of the French fries. No, that, I think I like that one. This one is the Rev, no surrender. Um, I'm thinking Rev is supposed to have a, have a like a, a higher caffeine content. Oh, oh wow. <laughs> Probably because it's a stronger coffee. I swear that was a car too. There was a car with Rev. I remember seeing that on the back. Somebody had wow, that's a bitter, 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 bitter yeah, coffee. It's worse than the first one. 
<laughs> yeah, it gets in there and, and takes a hold. You know what, I bet you some diehard black coffee drinkers uh -huh. will love that. That's who I think would like that. Yeah. I think if you drink black coffee, yeah, you really then like that. that means you like it strong anyway. Yeah, you like that strong, bitter Then flavor. I think that is the coffee for you. Out of out of all these, that would be the one that I would suggest to the black coffee drinker. Yeah, and, Rev. Yeah, and it says, uh, yeah, it doesn't say anything else, does it? No oh, it says dark, dark roast oh, coffee. Right. Makes sense. You probably read that though, didn't you? No, I didn't. Oh, um, yeah, that is definitely the strongest. And then the second one would be the Barney's yeah. as far as strength. Yeah. But now, I would, I would get the French roast one and you would get the The Colombian, but it's both the uh, Garibaldi brand mm -hmm. or Gar yeah, Garibaldi, Garibaldi. They're um, both pretty good. Yeah, those are nice. So Daniel, thank you for sending us these. We appreciate it very much. If any of you all have had these brands, you can let us know what you think. I know that you can get them on Amazon. Uh, so if I can find a link, I'll put it below for you. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.